March and April are big months for charity organizations that hold major fundraisers and galas, money those nonprofits count on to help families in need. So many of them have been canceled or rescheduled. Others are staying the course, but making changes for the sake of safety. So we have our major fundraising event, Recipe for Hope, that we plan every year. We start from the day it's over with to get it going for the next year, and that is coming up on Saturday. So the concern is, how do we keep it safe? Do we cancel it? Well, I don't think we need to cancel it. So we're going to do it and tell people if you're at risk, if you feel uncomfortable, please make that decision. We want you to be healthy. We want you to be safe, and we're going to do everything we can to up that um, that situation so that it is clean and over the top, over the top clean. So these are tough decisions that so many charity organizations and events are having to make. What kind of impact is this going to have on your organization? Everybody's struggling and as a nonprofit you you depend on these funds. Um, but we made the decision to do what was right for the community um, because safety and the health of the community was most important. And it was a tough decision. Um, so we, str we struggled with that. Babs is from Life's Work of Western Pennsylvania. It serves people with disabilities and other barriers to employment. Their March gala will be rescheduled. Meanwhile, both Babs and Bonnie say that Pittsburghers will rise up to help each other during this crisis.